first time that I've been photographed or filmed or please. All right, now tell me the story, Terry. I sat down to read for a few minutes because I wanted to read for a few minutes to come, come to the beach because I don't want to come to the beach too early. You know, uh, I've got enough sun. Yeah, that's understandable. The more sun, I'm going to look like a potato chip. Of course. <laughs> okay. it's not, it's not like you already don't look like it. Yeah. Okay, so what happened was I was sitting on like an unstable chair to begin with. He started to shake it. Oh, my God, what is wrong with this chair? Mm -hmm. And then, the, then I said, wait a minute. It's the building. It started going... This way, not this way, but this way. Oh my God! They're like rolling. Yeah. Oh my God! Oh my God! Oh my God! And then I looked out the window and I said, Oh my God! The building is moving. So I said, I know they're doing some work on the building. What are these stupid idiots doing? That they're making the building shake. <laughs> then I said, Oh, maybe my neighbor's in bed with her boyfriend, and maybe that's why the building is shaking. You know, I have a it's a six family three story house. Yeah. yeah. Well, then everybody said earthquake, earthquake, and I said. Damn. But we have had earthquakes before, but I never felt it like this. It was a 5.8 in Virginia. Yeah. You want to know something? It's too bad it didn't knock some of the buildings down in Manhattan. But they, they're not letting people in some of the buildings in Manhattan. And someone told me that they closed what? the Holland Tunnel. Really? So maybe there's a few cracks in it. Really? <clears throat> yeah, it was in Virginia. Right? How come they're not letting people into their buildings? In Manhattan, a uh, few of the buildings are not letting the people back in. Colorado had an earthquake too. Well, they might be afraid there might be another one or aftershocks. All right, so is this going to be open tomorrow too, this one? Oh, yeah. Oh, good, tomorrow. good. Now, when are you kids going to start going back to school? I'm tomorrow. Around here. Basically now. Is this, when are you going back? Uh, I'm something around for them. Oh, good, good. I'm, I'm good. going to call in a few days. Anybody want oatmeal, raisins, cookies? Uh, sure, I think. Okay. The kids never want to eat anything. That's why I don't bring you nothing. I bake, I bake oatmeal cookies for enough for the, the whole army. Stupid recipe called for three dozen. Oh my God. I, I think Pookie will take a cookie. He likes cookies. Yeah. Uh, he'll take one. He, he's just being shy. You know, your kids are lucky you don't like uh, He's just being shy. Say that. You know, Pookie's just really being shy. He gets shy around you. He told me that. Why should you be shy or afraid of me for? I'm not shy. <laughs> no, no. You think I'm afraid no, of you? No. If I swim with the freaking sharks, I'm not afraid of you. Like no, no. He told me every time he sees you, he gets nervous. You're the one who gets nervous. <laughs> You're the one who gets nervous. <laughs> not him. You're the one who gets nervous. <laughs> Why uh, don't you tell your your friends how you like to aggravate me? You uh, take such liberties with your <laughs> mouth. <laughs> you I love to aggravate. He okay. takes liberties with his mouth. But God doesn't exist, right? There's an old saying during the war, loose lips sink ships. Well, this one could have sunk the whole entire United States six fleet. All right, let me do my exercise. I just had an argument with Joe already. Oh, uh, that's terrible, Terry. He's such a nice person, but he's so stupid. Oh, I mean, oh God. If I had to live with somebody like him, I would be in Rikers Island for murder. Oh, I can't. I've got to live alone. I can't live with anybody. Are you really still doing this? Huh? What do you think I'm going to do, like, three months from now when I'm not on the beach anymore? I'm going to watch this. I'm going to laugh. It's okay. Yeah, I know. I hope you teach all your fellow students what I said. Yes, I'll, 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 liberties with the mouth. Such liberties with your mouth. Gosh. I watched the story of Joan Crawford last night on uh, Turner Classic movie. I didn't realize she was such a good actor. I wish I had a better camera. My camera's really shitty. Joan, Joan Crawford. You kids probably don't know who she is, do you? She did uh, Whatever Happens to Baby Jane with Betty Davis. Oh, was that a good movie. Are you done? Stuff to be the mill. May I go do my exercises? Go do your exercises, Terry. You know, I, I'm not going to ask you if God exists right now. Or well, later. the earthquake was just a sample, and you've got to be careful with your mouth. So you don't get struck with lightning. Right. Because if I don't believe in God, I'll get struck with lightning. No, that's not what I said. If, if I curse to God, I'll get struck with lightning. Do not curse. Not curse. God. No, I, I just want to test your theory. Maybe if I curse... Uh, the man over here is fascinated. He keeps looking at me, looking at me, looking at me. Who? I'm going to put the horns on him, too. All right, that's, that's enough, Terry. I think you could go to the exercises now.
you me now you're dismissing me. Oh, well, you wanted to leave. <laughs> Excuse me. Look what I have to put up with. Look what I have to put up with this one over here. I told him not to curse God because if he does, he'll get struck with lightning. But only if God exists. If he doesn't exist, look, look, wait, watch me, watch me. Look, let's make, let's, let's test this out, right? I'm going to curse to God right now. And don't, and God, if, if you exist within the next 10 don't, seconds, don't kill me, please. Okay? You God, get what you ask for. God, God, fuck you. Wait, wait, wait. One, okay. Mississippi. Okay. Two, Mississippi. Three, Mississippi. I'm going to tell you Four, something. You might not get struck by lightning today, but what makes it a, a year from now you get struck by lightning? Yeah, but... I could lost two horses by lightning. Yeah, but maybe they just got unlucky. It's not because of God. You know what I mean? Christopher. Christopher. Oh, yeah. Not Salvatore. Not Thomas. No. Christopher. Okay. Christopher, I'm going to answer something. I told him in a nice way not to curse God. Because if he does, he won't get struck by lightning. And he thinks it's a joke. You don't have to be struck by lightning right now. But no, I, I, I'm just cursing out your theory because I think. If I curse a guy, then I should get struck by lightning, and then it means God exists. But if I don't, then God doesn't exist, and then I'm going to ask God to But, am I right or am I right? That's what I thought. Don't tempt your faith, okay? No. Why not? Why not? I could tempt it all I want if I don't think fate exists. Life is what you make of it. There's no fate. Right, Terry? Well, Christopher, what do you, how do you feel about that? What? What? About yeah. cursing God? It's just perfect, right? What do you think about that? I don't know. It's perfect. I mean, if you don't, if you don't need to do it. <laughs> you what? You don't need to do it. Cause you know, Terry, if you fuck I, up. I didn't hear what you said. You don't need to do it. No, you don't need to do it. Sure. It's something that, God if you're going to college, God. yes. If, if you're going to college, you should have some intelligence, because otherwise you wouldn't be Yeah, there. and that's why I don't believe in God. Okay, a lot of young people go through that phase, they don't believe in God, but I would not. Well, you didn't give me one reason to believe in God, throughout the whole summer. Well, first of all, you're existing, and secondly, you're here for the grace of God. That's not a reason why God exists. I would be here regard like, well, don't, irrelevant don't of God. Don't your faith. Right. Perry. You learned two things from me. If you didn't learn anything from me, you learned two things. What are those two things? Watch your mouth and don't test, tempt your don't tempt your fate. And don't take liberties with my mouth. Yeah, well same thing. Watch okay. your mouth. Don't take liberties with your mouth. Exactly. And don't tempt your fate. I will remember that come winter time. Yeah, because you could be driving your car and skin on the ice and slam into the utility pole. But that could happen whether or not I believe in God. Well, don't curse him. Okay. I'll, I'll try. Funny guy.